Yo, what is up, you two? This is Pure Kicks back again with another performance review. It feels so good. Yes, sir. You guys have already read the title, and today we are finally taking a look at the Nike Kyrie Sevens. Let's get it. Real quick, massive shout out to Pro Direct Basketball for hooking your boys up. If you'd like a pair of the Nike Carry 7s, the link to their website will be in the description box below. So definitely check that out. Before we get into it, you guys know the vibes. This is a performance review. So we did 150 likes. 150. 150 likes on a Kyrie 7 performance review. You must. We're back now. That's all we ask. Smash up that like button. Right quick, don't forget to comment as well. Subscribe to the Ting, subscribe to Pure Kicks. We're back, baby. And of course, follow your boys on Instagram. This is Pure Kicks every single time. Now let's get into the review. 92 was a fine year. Elaborate for the people there. Fine, fine year. I myself, born in 92. And Kyrie Irving, also. Oh, Kyrie was born in 92, yeah? 92, baby. Oh, that's sick, a fam. Fine year for Hoovers. Kyrie Seven is here. <laughs> Kyrie Irving has been here, settling in nicely in Brooklyn. Yeah, we're not talking about all that because it's looking up still. Yeah, but let's get into the shoe, bro. The first thing we have to talk about is this traction pattern. Come on, guy. let's talk about it. In our first impressions, we called it the car tire traction pattern, Thanks. but it's more uh, correctly known as the computer engineered three sixty degree Jeez. traction pattern. So basically, it's CGI. It's CGI, it's CGI bro. It's Mad a madness, bro. Mad thing, mad thing, mad thing. What I love about it the most is that not only do we have it on the medial side, but it's also on the lateral side as well, which is a nice little touch. Yeah. The blades are really deep as well. Mm. Um, we hooped on, on on a slightly dusty court. Slightly, only slightly, but it held up so well. So so well. So well. I would say as well, I think they'd be okay outdoors. Yep. I feel like I'm confident they'll be well outdoors. We've yep. only run a little bit outdoors, but I'm confident they'll, they'll hold up really well. However, I will say, the bite weren't that aggressive. Yeah. It didn't quite match the pattern. This being Kyrie shoe, we were looking for that aggressive bite. Mm, which we're used to. Exactly. And we didn't get that. So that was one small gripe. As, as us being paid. Yeah. So for that reason, hold a nine out of 10. Yeah, hold a nine out of 10. You were close though. The bite weren't really biting the way we yeah. know it to bite. It's just, it's not as good as some of the transcendent carry yeah, traction that, 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 that we've received in the past, Facts. you know what I'm saying? Facts. But it's definitely still up there. It's in there. But it's not, it's not, it's not a 10 out of 10. There you go. It's not today. Next up, talking about the cushioning. Yes, our next favorite part of the shoe, which is surprising sometimes when we talk yeah. Kyrie. For the third year in a row, Zoom Turbo returns yeah. in the forefoot where it's supposed to be. A young file on carrier, mm, okay. Mm. People don't like it, innit? I, I love it. I like it. I don't love it, because we were teased three years ago with what should be the carrier. Should right. be pushed on, bro. Right, anyway, right. talking about the seven, Zoom Turbo does its thing, right? right? Why? Court feel, fantastic stuff we're seeing here today. Yeah. Response in abundance. Yeah. Every step is quick. It's amazing. It's a little lacking when we're talking in protection and cozy boy swag. Yes, it is. And that's just what's going to happen. Why? Because thinking about it, guards don't really care about those two things. No. You're close to the ground, you're quick on every step. So as a Kyrie shoe, that kind of makes sense. Yeah, for sure. But it's still lacking. Yeah, 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 yeah. And yeah. lacking loses points. Yes, it does. You're right. What are you saying? Right. I want to give it a 9 out of 10, innit? I want to give it a 7. So we'll give it eight out of ten. I don't, I don't, I don't mind that in it. I'll meet, I'll meet you halfway. On Appreciate that. They can. <laughs> <laughs> Real quick, if you're enjoying this content, make sure you like this video. 150 likes, we need the that. 150. 150. Comment down below what your thoughts of the Carry Sevens are, and of course, subscribe to our YouTube channel, Instagram as well. We're very active over there. Come on, so follow us on that or all, all other socials at This Is Pure Kick. Next up, we have the materials. Now I'm going to mention this, Timmy was quite mad at the fact that the materials upset. are just mesh. Okay, I'm Regular, quoting him. Bro. Man said it's just mesh, you know. Regular. And mesh does the job, bro. It does, but it's like, it does a basic job. It's like, it's like the employee who gets in at 9 and leaves at 5.30. That's it. That's all the you're getting The job is me. done, bro. You're paying him and he's doing the job that basic you're paying him to job. do. Basic job. Basic guys, bro. Do you know what I'm saying? I hear it though. It does what you need to do, bro. It's breathable. Yeah, it's, it's extremely lightweight. Facts. Bro, what more do you want? 
Okay, fair enough. I would like materials to be more uh, 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 flexible. Okay, word. that's what I'm waiting uh, for this one. Breaking time was a bit mad. It was a little tough. It was it's one of those shoes that I definitely mm. recommend you walk around the house a little bit if you before, can before you hoop. Yes, but you'd still be fine. It takes about half hour, forty five minutes ish to break into in. your session when you're already sweating and panting already. So, mm -hmm. but it's but a carry shoe. Once it is done, though, yeah, enjoy life. Exactly. Once the breaking time is done, which is a tough journey, enjoy life. Did you or did you not say that you forgot you had the shoes on? When we was playing the other day. I told you that in confidence. That yes, weren't were for the camera. I, I brought it up because you're talking left, bro. i got to bring you back right onto the right path. Facts. Yes, it is indeed true. I did feel as if I just didn't realise I was what shoes I had speak on. Speak up, bro. Speak up. I didn't care what shoes I had on. I was just hooping because that's what a good shoe should make any hooper feel like. There you go. So what have you given the score for the materials? It can, it can hold an eight. Thank you very much. It can much. hold an eight. Thank it you deserves that eight. I ain't going to lie. Yes. It deserves an eight. It deserves an eight. Next up, talking about the fit. There are some concerns here. Timmy's concerns, not oh my, my concerns, gosh. isn't it? All right, I'm going to start off with this. It's a narrow fit issue. Yes. All right, Kyrie's have been known to be a little bit on the narrow side. That, in my personal opinion, should, you should like that. Hey, let me interrupt you. Sorry, carry on. No, like, interrupt. Yeah, that's, that's, I feel like you should like that, Timmy. Why no? should I like that? Because you're... you're, you're, you're <laughs> <laughs> Because your feet be long and narrow like Kyrie's, bro. That's why. Uh, yeah, calm. 92 anyway, babies. Sorry. This is what it is. Now, what I'm saying is, yes, narrow fit issue is a Kyrie issue. It's, yeah. for, it's for him. Yeah. I just feel like the materials, like we just said, don't really help. The breaking time means that, I mean, the stiff materials don't help with breaking time. Right. And the experience of first putting them on is so regular. Yeah, fair enough. It's a little like, mm -mm -mm, but it's, n it's not, hmm. You know what, Timmy? I feel like you're too focused on how the shoe feels when you first put them on rather than how it feels once they're broken in. No, that's a fact. This is exactly what I'm talking about right now. But I believe the first try on should have, should be an experience. I, I feel like, I so, I feel like some materials have just spoiled you, bro. My dilemma is obviously we ordered the size, I got a size 10. Yep. Yeah. And you know, they were a bit tight when I first wore them, but mm. once they're broken, they were fine. Mm. However, if I'd gone to the store mm. to try them on, I would have asked for a 10 and a half, and I've probably left the store with a 10.5. So there you have it. So basically, in, in a nutshell, try and either order both sides to try them on at home, or if you do go to the store, ask for both and really get a run around in them at least. But I'm glad that I didn't get a 10.5 because the 10 broke in beautifully. So, so it's one of them ones, isn't it? It's really down to you in terms yeah. of preference. Now the lacing system does help as well because it kind of gives you that really nice hug to the foot especially in that midfoot area. So overall, the fit isn't great, but it's good, so it's gonna have to hold a seven. Yeah, it does the job. It's above average, yeah, yeah. right? It's just super regular, and the materials that take ages to break in don't particularly help the cause, so hold the seven. Lastly, talking about the support, which again, historically, this is where the carry does well for mm -hmm. a guard shoe. Uh, it comes from the lockdown. The lockdown comes from the lacing system. We have these molded fins that help anchor your forefoot down. Obviously, your heel is also locked down with this internal TPU heel counter. We have the outrigger shape of the shoe, which is, I feel like, is extremely exaggerated. It is pretty good. Uh, it's amazing. Um, definitely helps with the lateral support. I always feel like the carry shoes are are some of the more supportive shoes for guards on the market. I have to agree, bro. And they just they just get their job done, really. When we're talking play styles, I mean, it's going to be this shoe when we talk guard support. Yeah. It needs to allow a player like Kyrie to move, but still hold him in place. Yeah. The padding around the collar area does exactly that. Yeah. It doesn't come up too high. I would, I think it's a more mid cut. Right. But before a high cut, I would say. But they're just where they need to be to yeah. hold the ankle really well and still allow him to move and any other player just like it. Yeah. Overall, I really enjoyed the support. I felt pretty locked in the whole time I was wearing these. It's going to have to hold an eight for a score, bro. Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't mind what that at all. Yeah, eight is calm. Eight is calm. Eight it is. So, right, guys, looking at all the scores, the Nike Kyrie 7 comes out at an away above average 8.0 out of 10. Very calm, you know? Consistency is key right here. For sure. If you guys remember, go back to our last Kyrie 6 performance review, find out what score we gave it then. Yeah, yeah, It's yeah. doing bits. Also, I just want to point out, had this been a flow review, 
the Kyrie might have got a 9.4 in it, but it's calm. Timmy had to give his little two cents, and now we have an 8.0. So it's all down to preference, you know what I'm saying? It's down to what you like. Opinions and facts are all involved in the conversation. Right. Facts have to come out on top because it is what it is. Objective versus subjective, we can't be here all day. So 8.0 out of 10 is the score. Thank you. Once again, massive shout out to Pro Direct Basketball. The Kyrie Sevens are fire. So why not check out the Pro Direct Basketball? Because they've got all the fire colorways over there. They even have the Kyrie Four Lows, which technically isn't the low top version of this shoe. Mm. But Loki kind of isn't the same. Time. Just like go to the website, man. Go Hella check options. it out. Hella options. Hella options on the website. As always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. We really, really appreciate you guys. It's good to be back. If you've made it this far, make sure you hit that like button just to show a little love. It helps us out massively. We need 150 of those joints. If you look down and it's not a 150, do your part. Hit that button right quick. It massively helps us out. We appreciate it. Comment down below what your thoughts are on the Kyrie 7. Was you feeling them? Was you not? Are you looking to copper pair? Are you not? Let us know down below. And of course, hit that beautiful red button and the bell next to it to get notified every time we drop a new video and lastly don't forget to follow your boys on instagram twitter and all the socials out there at this is pure kicks for everything you need to know outside of all these videos that includes events that includes uh giveaways that includes just what timmy and flo get up to when they're not on the court who we normally are i'm not gonna lie this is what we do make sure you follow us over there much love so right guys it's everything from us this is the nike carry seven we're pure kicks let's, let's get, get it, it. boom